Hello lords and ladies and welcome to Delicatorium. I'm your host Shade Renard and today we're going to try Jolly Rancher's new Pop-Tarts cherry flavor. Now these are limited edition. I don't know if you guys are going to be able to find them but I saw them on the shelf and I had to pick them up. Now they've got three different flavors and I'm going to bring you the other two in additional videos after this one. But right now we're going to try the cherry. Now I'm not really huge on Jolly Ranchers. Like I do like the candies. They're good. Uh... I'm just not really like, into, like, some of their sour flavors. Um, like, I think the Blue Raspberry one is my favorite. But, like, um, the Watermelon one, for example, I think is a little overpowering. It's a really good flavor, but it's a little overpowering. Um, I believe they have, like, uh, Jolly Rancher Popsicles. Like, those, um... Like, they come in, like, the, the plastic, and then you just put them in the freezer, they freeze. And, you know, they fill up with the liquid or whatever. I didn't like them as popsicles, but let's try them as pop tarts. Wow, that is like really sweet. Like disgustingly sweet, like way too much sugar. Hmm. And to be honest with you, I'm not really a big fan of cherry. But, yeah, like, all three of them, I think they're like a buck forty a piece for the, um, each box they had them on sale, so. I figured, why the hell not? Hmm. I don't know what to think, really. It looks like this, though. Like, you know, red with pink swirls. I don't know. I think they're good. They're really sweet, though. Like, I don't see me eating more than, like, a single pack of these. Like, at one time. Like... I don't know if you guys know, but the Wild Berry Pop-Tarts are my absolute favorite. I will crush an entire box of those without even thinking about it, because they just, they taste so damn good. These, though, I could never see me doing that. Like, maybe one pack a day, you know, like, if I were to put it, like, in my lunchbox or something when I go have my lunch for work or something like that, alright, you know, a little sweet snack. Sure, but, like... You know, prop tarts are supposed to be like, you know, like a, a breakfast pastry. This is not a breakfast pastry. This is like a, a, a sweet dessert tart or whatever. I do not see this being like a breakfast pastry. Like, oh yeah, let me just toss this in the toaster real quick and have this on my way to work. You know, for my breakfast. Absolutely not. No, that'd be disgusting. And honestly, like, I don't heat up pop tarts. Like, I think the only ones I might would probably be, like, the s'mores ones. But even then, like, you know, your uh, toaster toasts the, uh, the side with the icing, and then it's just all weird. I don't know. I don't like toast and Pop-Tarts. Now, toaster strudels, that's a different fact altogether. That's a completely different thing. I love those. Hmm. Well, you know what? I think these cherry ones are halfway decent. And I like them quite a bit. So, I'm going to have to say that these are definitely a thumbs up in my book. Give that a product positive. So, I'm going to say that, uh, well, I don't know. We'll give it a 7 out of 10. What do you think? Sounds good to me. But uh, if you guys want to see more stuff from me, check the links in the description below. And if you guys want to get this, check the links in the description below. And as always, like, comment, and subscribe. And hit that bell icon so you guys know when I have future uploads. And don't worry, the next Jolly Rancher Pop-Tart videos are coming up soon. Right after this one. So stay tuned. And we will see you at Journey's End. Ta-ta.